wait but also you can send message right you can send message uh, through the chat okay maybe that i will stop and then respond to your questions right or you can also respond in the non verbal participant okay you can respond also in non verbal participant for all that um, things that you want to ask during my presentation okay i think that there are few video is not started yet i would like to see your videos guys would you please start the videos i have seen few videos already here okay thanks a lot for those who are started already please show your videos uh, students show your videos please yeah yeah show your videos okay very good nice to see you all okay let's wait mohammad to start sefina alif who else here raihan okay very good novina muhammad farhan iya pak okay Uh, this I don't recall the name here. One nine one zero nine three one zero zero four. We please also start your videos. Farhan, can you hear me? No. Okay. Okay. Very good. So okay fine so no problem so we have novina in 191093 is not started the video yet okay no problem okay let me start my slide i have slide that you can uh, refer to later on yeah a minute <clears throat> Can you see my slide? Yes, sir. Yeah, very good. Thank you. Okay. Okay, prior to start my uh, presentation, uh, I just want to know how many of you uh, knows about slumbersy? Can you respond in a non-verbal participant panel? If you know about slumbersy, you can just say uh, respond with a yes or just yes or uh, put the check a green check there you know i'm talking about the non verbal participant panel the chat the chat panel yeah as well it's the non verbal participant panel i don't see anyone respond yet let me see go to non verbal verbal participant panel and then just let me know if you know about slumbersy please uh, all the students answer through the chat if you know say yes if you don't know say no yeah mm -hmm. at the chat section please yeah at the chat also in that i want actually in the participant panel party not in the chat uh, you in the chat also okay fine if you are familiar okay. with chat no problem okay. okay okay i have a response already from uh, haura okay no one no 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 yes i got from response from alif yes no okay yes okay i got two yes no I got only two yes. I got three yes. Okay. How many students we have so far? Let me just check. How many students do we have, uh, Padi? My students is only like 26 or 25, but there are other students from other classes as well. Okay. So right now, how many that we have in, in this Zoom? Oh, 43 students. Oh, 45 43 students. 45 students. Okay, 43, I think it's only three or four students who knows about slumbersy. Okay, very good. Okay, good, All right? So thanks a lot for those who are responding. It's okay, All right? So this, the name is slumbersy, right? So uh, it's not easy to mention it. It's like slumbersy. Uh, even still remember uh, my uh, father asked me a uh, long time back, where did I walk? Slumbersy, is it a burger company? I told him, yeah, it's a burger company. We are making the burger. <laughs> so basically, uh, Slumbersy is like the 
oil surface company. I will explain later on about Slumbergy, right? So for those who knows about Slumbergy, okay, so maybe it will be just refreshing to you, the refresh, but I will explain later on about Slumbergy, what we are doing basically, right? So this is about me. Right? Before we, uh, I introduce, introduce about Slumbergy, let me introduce, introduce about myself first. Okay, my name is Nofri Muluk. Uh, I'm Indonesian, and currently I'm located in uh, Abu Dhabi with my families here as the instructor. Right? Uh, we have the training center in uh, Abu Dhabi. Uh, they call it Middle East Learning Center. So we have few learning center in uh, Slumbersea. We have one here in Middle East, and we have uh, one in US, uh, Calivir Learning Center, and we have also uh, one in uh, Russia, Siberian Training Center, and we have also uh, one in France, right? So that's all the those cent training center that we have in uh, Slumbersea. So I've been working, as Padi informed you before, I've been working with uh, Slumbersea more than 22 years. Okay, more than 22 years, uh, 22 years I've been working in, in oil field. And then the last two years, I spent my career here in uh, MLC as the instructor or as the lecturer. Okay, so I've been located with, uh, I've been assigned with a various position, either in the field or in the office. Okay, so I've been assigned in five different countries. I've been assigned in Indonesia. I started I started my career in Indonesia, and then I moved to Oman, and then I moved to India with my family. I worked in India for 10 years, so long time, and then I moved to Malaysia, and then now I'm in UAE. So a lot of exposure, actually, uh, with my uh, assignment in uh, Slumbersea. Okay, uh, let me share, uh, let me just share with you one short video explaining about Slumbersea. Uh, let me just share with you the sound first, just a minute. Mr. Sound, okay, just enjoy these videos. We are Schlumberger, the leading provider of technology and service. Wait, yeah, let me increase the speaker. Services to the energy industry Can across you hear the, the sound? world. No? Throughout much of the oil. Yes, yes, we can hear it. Yes, we can hear it, sir. Country. We design, develop. We are Schlumberger, the leading provider of technology and services to the energy industry across the world. Throughout much of the oil and gas life cycle, in over 120 countries, we design, develop, and deliver technology that transforms how work is done. We're looking for innovators who share our passion for discovery to help take us into the next generation of energy. We'll get there doing what we've always done, harnessing our talented people's drive and giving them the platform to do truly outstanding work. Our greatest strength is the diversity of our people. Differences in thought, creativity, and experiences make us better every day. And together, we create amazing technology that unlocks access to energy for the benefit of all. We are built on leadership, science, and innovation and always aim to extend the technical limits of our industry. Wherever you join us, you'll be part of a global community of colleagues working together to realize ambitious goals and sharing real pride in what we accomplish. Here, you'll discover what you can really do. We'll support you with world-leading learning and development, a meritocratic culture, and our borderless career structure that ensures you build skills by continually taking on work that challenges you. If you want to help shape the future of energy and push the limits of what's possible, then this is the place for you.
Pak Nofri, maybe you forget to turn on your mic, I think. We cannot, we cannot hear you at all. Buddy? Yes, I, we can hear you now. Okay. So let me go back to the preview slide. Okay. As I informed you before, right, we are, who are Slumbergy? We are actually the largest provider of technology to the energy industry. Okay. And this is the story of Slumbergy. The Slumbergy started in 1930. So how they started, basically it was two brothers, uh, uh, Mark and Conrad Slumbergy. Their name is uh, Slumbergy, Mark and Conrad Slumbergy. They invented the, the core of Slumbergy, which is like wildland business. And then as you can see it here, uh, they started in France and then it started only in few countries. And then they acquired a lot of other companies because of the Slumbergy are the leaders, right? So they are able to acquire a lot, lot of other company, right? Till now they keep growing basically, right? Till now they keep growing. So what we do basically, what we do, right? what we do in Slumbergy, we apply the science and technology solution to help the customer. So we provide the solutions to our customer. So it means that we are the service company. We provide the, uh, the service to our customer to be able to gain the effective of the hydrocarbon product production. Okay. So now with the hydrocarbon, it's more difficult to be able to produce the hydrocarbon because of it's not easy to produce. So with our technology, we are able to get a more effective uh, cost to our customer, to our client. So how we do it and what we do basically. So we have few different surface or we have few different segments that we are categorized that our, in our company. We have that uh, reservoir character, characterization. Basically this is uh, the segment of this is mainly focused on the reservoir. And then we are also having that uh, segment that more focus on the how to construct the wells. And then we have also the segment is more focused on how to uh, produce the reser reservoir, uh, relative with the reservoir. And then also we have the segment that focus on the delivery. So here on this segment that what we have basically, we have few different sub segment we have few different surface so since that we acquire all a more, lot of company already in slumbersy so we can provide it to our customer all the surface that which is like not all the uh, surface company in oil field having all the surface so we are able to provide seismic surface so as i told you before the main core business of slumbersy is wildland and for me, uh, I'm specialist on reservoir production on pressure pumping. So here in all, each, each of these segment has their own technology, right? So it's like, it's not easy to learn each of these uh, surface here. So I've been uh, working with uh, Slumbersy now more than 22 years. I can tell you, I don't know about all the other surface here. I am specialist only with pressure pumping. See, so much technology that we have is very difficult to be able to gain or to be able to understand all the other uh, surface in uh, other, in, even in my company in Slumbersy. Right? It's a lot of a lot of technology, a lot of uh, 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 invest, investment that also that Slumbergy already did to be able to be the leader in oil field. Okay, so what we believe basically, right? So what we believe, uh, we believe in Slumbergy, we believe is with the people because we are providing the service to our customer. Means that you need to make sure that you will be able to deliver the good uh, quality of service to your customer. So that's why we believe 
our people is the asset means that with the good people or with that uh, what we call this one knowledge people and then with the high technology then we will be able to get the profit okay so as i told you before right people is our greatest asset so we believe this one this is what i i also believe people is our greatest asset so we have now as what party informed you before we have more than 100000 employees in the world right and then we are actually operating more than 120 uh, countries right now and then we have more than 140 nationalities so here uh, can say right in slumberji there is no racism right i mean if you have a capability whatever that you are nationalities whatever that you are uh, religion right whatever that your sex is it doesn't matter right as long as that you are capable then you can have the career in slumberji right so we learn and grow every day right this is as uh, you seen also or you seen also in the videos right it's like borderless career as i informed you also before i have been assigned in five different countries right so in slumberji there is no border actually everywhere that you can uh, move or everywhere that you can walk in as long as that there is the opportunity or as long as there is that you are capable also to be able to do that kind of the responsibility right so what we also believe in slumbersy we give you the the opportunities to take the early responsibility It means that we will uh, re recruit the people right and then we will train you and then we'll give you um the opportunity to deliver the service or deliver the job by yourself right so we can say that each of the job that might be it will cost the client at least around 100,000 dollar right so it's like very costly job sometimes up to 1 million dollar for each of the job that you you will perform by yourself later on right so but to be able to get that to take the responsibilities you need to have the training right that's why we have the step in our company uh, in slumberji we have the structure of the learning program right so when you are joining a uh, company when you are joining slumberji you will get the orientation first you will meet a new friend you will meet uh, all the other culture there right as what uh, i inform you before we have around 140 uh, nationalities that working with uh, slumberji we will meet a lot of uh, people from other countries right this is when you start that your career with slumberji and then you will get a step one training right so you will go into the step one training you get that all the technical training related with that whatever the uh, surface that you are joining into this slumbersy right and then also you will get a step two they call it or and then they will get a step three right and then you will get the more experience gain experience so basically in slumbersy you will have the training opportunities right you will always get the training right so within uh, this step uh, training within three years you must be able to complete this training and then you will go with your uh, experience uh, training right so with the when you gain the experience then you can move to other position in slumbersy you can move to the sales you can move to the operation management you can move to the personal or you can move to the techni technical part right this is how we uh, structure our uh, learning program in slumbersy right so it's like it's clear actually it has the clear uh, step and then it has also clear guideline what you have to do within the uh, time bound okay so let's see right so let's dig deeper into that our uh, starting point or into that our operation basically right so when you are recruited uh, or when you are joining into the operation okay so you will be able to get the opportunities right to be the field right you will work in the field mostly 
for the engineer, we will assign them in the field first, right? You will be in the field first. You need to know what we do, basically, right? And then you will get the, the when you get more experience, then you will become uh, the analyst. Or you can also become the maintenance engineer at the base, right? So this is the operation people. So the operation people, basically the disciplines that what normally we recruit the people is all engineering. So whatever that you are uh, disciplined, it doesn't matter, right? It's a machine or whatever is that is no problem, right? And then the qualification in their bachelor, master or PhD, it doesn't matter, okay? So then you will get the uh, lifestyle, right? So I mean that you will be able to see the field. I think that uh, none of you have seen the field yet, right? So when you're joining that um, slumber seat, then you will be able to see the how the field work, okay? Or how the field life. Okay, this is the operation. Okay, let's see uh, what we have in the technology uh, development. Okay, so in the technology development, you will get the opportunities also uh, in the product center, right? And then you will be also the software technology, and then also house the engineering and the mass manufacturing station. This is also the product center, and then also in the research, right? And for this, you can also become this. This is actually the assignment, right? international staff or local staff or uh, uh, what we call it when there are, um, whatever the, uh, the assignment that they will assign to you, right? And then either whatever that you are disciplines also that you have, either math or whatever, that, that this is that what we uh, prefer to be in the technology development, right? So either that you have the bachelor, master or PhD, and then you are, you will be able to join in slumber seat, okay? So for the technology that it will be office or also in the lab. And this is the science and petrotechnical. Similar uh, with the technology development, right? The discipline that we are actually looking to is all this, right? Mostly into the petroleum engineering for the geoscience and petrotechnical, right? Similar, must be bachelor degree and master degree. And then for the commercial, similar, Right. This is the commercial, right? we are having the people. Uh, you will be able to get the opportunities into uh, human resources, sales, uh, finance, information technology, supply chain. So these are the disciplines that we are looking into uh, to be able to join this uh, commercial and business. Right? The cooperation must be commercial bachelor degree and master degree. Okay, you will be mostly for this position will be in uh, office. Okay, so any questions guys? Okay, is there any question from the students? You can raise your hand or you can speak directly. Who is asking question? Yeah, Friska, go ahead. Yes, yeah, sir. So. Good uh, afternoon, sir. Maybe it's still afternoon there, right? And uh, I want to introduce myself first. My name is Friska, and I want to ask a question. So my question is, when we want to apply to Slumbergy, sorry if I pronounce it wrong. No, so it's, when it's we want good. to apply to Slumbergy, mm -hmm. what are the most important thing that uh, Slumbergy see from the applicants? Like, uh, what is the most important requirements? I think okay. that's... So uh, first, right, uh, there is that, I will share with you the link. All right, let me share with you the link that you can go through that link, right? But yes, for sure, um, uh, what we call this one, they will see that uh, your academic uh, qualification first, right? That's one of the criteria, that academic qualification. So, but I can tell you also, sometimes not depend on how uh, what we call this one, that how qualified you are, right? So I will just send, share with you the link. Let me just give it. You can go through that link, right? You can just explore it because even myself, 
I will not be able to submit your application. You need to submit yourself. And there is team in Slumbersy that will do that uh, recruitment that will look into your profile. And then you are uh, capable enough, right? And then they will call you. Is that answering your question, Friska? Yes, sir. Thank you. Sir. Yeah. Okay, let me share with you the uh, link. Pa, pa no free. My, my yes. question is, uh, from your experience, yeah, what Sumber C sees uh, in uh, qualified, uh, uh, how do you call it, chalon, yeah, uh, employee, yeah? The candidate, right? The candidate. So that's yeah. what I, I, I inform party. I mean that. They will not see uh, also that how qualified. I mean, the event that you are come come loot, right? No. But um, if you you uh, you need to go through the the test basically, um, okay, right? There is that. But first, right, uh, CV must be submitted, right? So then they will see also. So let me just share with you the the current link. Uh, I will I will come back to you, Briska. I will share with you later on that. The link. Right? I will share with okay. you uh, the that how to submit also. Yeah. Right, okay. You, okay. Thanks a lot, Priska, for for asking the questions. Okay. Let me put any other question, Priska, because you're still uh, raising that your hand. Oh, sorry, sir. Uh, yeah, but I have one still. I have still one question. Yes. Um, how tight is the competitions if you want to apply in the slumber G, sir? It's very high, right? Uh, I can tell you when I recruited 22 years back, I was selected from I think 5,000 of people. So, and then this presentation, what I presented to you, this is the same presentation what they presented in other university. And mostly, I, uh, they will come The recruiter will come and do visit to uh, ITB, and then they will do recruit there. So this already, what we call this one, that uh, reduce that your opportunity because you are in Padang, right? So because the the what we call this one, the the sport that what we have, what they have normally in uh, Slumberj, there is the the uh, the limited sport for recruiting the people you got my point so might be in a year right from indonesia they will only recruit especially at this condition with this current uh, crisis pandemic that we have uh, the recruitment got uh, freeze now you got my point Friska, right it's like they stop recruiting but when they do recruiting there is the limited seat that they will recruit from Indonesia. And then uh, we can tell you maybe, I don't know the number, right? But maybe let's say uh, from all Indonesia, let's say they only have the limited 100 seat available, right? And then if they already selected around 20 from ITB, and then around 80 more that we, it will be share between whoever submitted into the career center. Uh, Panofri, are you still there? Maybe your mic. We lost Panofri, I think. I think we lost him. <laughs> okay. Just wait, yeah. Just wait. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Ah, Panofri is still there. We yeah. Your your mic is uh, mute, muted. Your mic is muted, Panofri. Yeah, sorry, I got disconnected. Right? You got disconnected. Yeah. So I think that I I uh, I got disconnected when I told you the recruitment was from uh, the first priority, 
right? For slumber gene, normally when they do recruitment, it will be either ETB, UE, uh, UGM, or ETS, right? So these are the four uh, main university they normally recruit, right? But, but don't lose hope. I mean, because that's why I will share with you because it's not all also that people got the opportunities right, to have this presentation. I mean, you are kind of lucky that got these opportunities and then have this presentation because it's not many people knows also this site, right? Website. Let me just share with you what is the website that you can go through it. And I will just go with you as well uh, through this website. Wait a minute. Let me just open. Yeah. Just a minute. Yeah. Let me find the website first. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Let me share with you guys. Yeah, you can go to this website uh, and then you can submit your application. And actually, you can get, they call it intern. You can get the opportunities to apply as intern and it will be more chance or possibility for you to join company, to join Slumbercy, right? So in turn, uh, it's like uh, that exposure prior you start working in uh, company, right? So we have uh, uh, the base in Indonesia. We are operating uh, in Duri, and then we have also in Jakarta, uh, and Bali Papan, right? So those are the main base that we have. But we are also operating in uh, uh, Palembang, Jambi, and then also in Aceh. But mainly uh, the main three base is in Duri, uh, Jakarta, and Bali Papan. Okay. Thank you. Is that answering your question, Afriska? Can everyone uh, open that uh, website? Puji, can you open the website? Can you respond? If you can open the website, I just share with you in the chat. Can you go through that uh, website and then just explore it, right? Just explore it, okay? Any other questions from the participant here? Any other questions, students? No? I don't think one of the here. Usually if they have questions, they just put it in chat. They don't ah, okay. directly, uh, usually uh, in my class. Okay, if not, I think that's all from my side. Uh, thanks a lot again, Paadi. I hope all the best to all of you guys. Okay. Now we have questions, yeah, uh, about we, we, uh, yeah, you are in my human resource management class actually, yeah. And right. uh, okay, we have question because uh, 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 Slumberzy, oh, Slumberzy, <laughs> Slumberzy is uh, and and and. An enterprise is a big company because it's operating all around the world. Yeah, and what we want to know in our class, yeah, how uh, Salam Brazil yeah, manages uh, the human resource. Because, yeah, you already saw us the about the, uh, the the training that they have for like three years, is it before? Right. Yeah, and do they also have other other training for 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 their employees? Uh, yes. For, for, for example, it's like you've been working for like 22 years, yeah? How many trainings yeah. that you got? Like five years and you got another training and 10 years or things like that. Yeah. Okay, thanks a lot, Padi, for asking that question. All right. So I just want to inform you guys. Uh, currently, I'm as the, uh, the instructor and then also as the uh, Human XRDL, HRD, right? They call it SRD in... Um, Slumbercy, right? So in Slumbercy, uh, um, when you are 
that uh, step training and you will get all the other training, whatever the position that you need to uh, do it later on. As I inform you in future, let me just share with you the slide here. My slide again. Yes. Yeah, right. So when you gain the experience after three years, all of this to be able for you to be able to deliver this job, you will need the specific training, right? So either you are as the marketing and sales, so each of these you will get a training, right? So then each of these will have the specific training that you have to go through it, right? So for myself, uh, with my career, I've been uh, attending at least more than 15 training, if uh, just the official one. It's like a lot of training that I have to uh, attend. And then it, I have to pass that training. It's not just like kind of the training. And then you are not uh, pass the mark that uh, has been set into that training and then you will get uh, terminated from the company. So it's like qualification training because we want to have the qualified people. It's not, we are not just only giving the training basically, right? So in terms of that, how we, um, we uh, uh, evaluate the people, we have the call it that like um, yearly, that evaluation. So the manager, your direct manager will evaluate you, right? And then we'll be in that, uh, the web-based program is clear. It's like the objective is clear. So how we do it? Um, before starting of the year, that your manager will set the objective for you, right? And then depend on the result at the end of the year, that's how you will get your uh, grade how you will get your mark. Based on that your mark or your grade, then you will get the increasing of the bonus or whatever the decision from the management, right? So if you get lower grade right, or lower mark, then you might get terminated, right? So it's like ranking A, B, C, D, right? You get A, you will get more money, but you get D, then you might get terminated, right? <laughs> So it's a bit, so a bit hard like, to, work, to work in some Brazil, yeah? pa pa no free, yeah? Because you please repeat that again, Paddy? It is quite hard to work in some Brazil because is, you might get I, terminated. It, it is hard. I, it is hard because we want to have the qualified qualified people. Right? It's no easy money. Right? I mean that because see, as I told you before, that job that what we do. Is like will cost the client maybe up to one million dollar, and then it's not only up to that one million dollar to be able to perform that specific job. Client will need to do investment, right? Because a lot of other activities, a lot of other uh, service, they need to perform. The client need to perform, and only they will be able that you will be able to perform your specific job basically, right? So this is. Is high cost, right? Yeah, but yes, high reward basically, right? Okay. High risk, high reward. High risk, high reward. Yeah, thank you. You, you will earn it, but you are not capable. That's it. Right? Okay, thank you. Okay. Any others to send to have, have a question? Because I still have a question actually. <laughs> Any other students? Okay, my next question, Papa Nofri. Yeah. Go ahead, Papa. Okay, uh, as a manager in human resource management, as a manager, uh, they are the ones who define, yeah, the yeah, yeah the, the the qualifications or maybe the training that uh, should be put uh, into the onto the employees, yeah. So my question right. is, yeah, because you are from the field, yeah, uh, how yes. can you be uh, into into a training at the moment, a training uh, position as a trainer and also in human resource at the moment? Okay, so thanks a lot, Pardi, for asking the questions. Right, so because um, most of the people that got recruited, right, so you have especially for those who are uh, the operation people, you need to go to the field first, right? Since I got a lot of exposure already in the field, and then I need 
to be able to deliver, how to be able to perform the job safely, safely and successfully. Because this oil field is high risk, right? It's a lot of risk involved with this operation, right? You can say um, um, uh, the operation that how the risk that we involve. We are dealing with the uh, uh, what we call it heavy equipment, right? We are dealing with a crane. We are dealing with a truck. We are dealing with the uh, all that all the heavy equipment actually, right? And then we are working in the field. If you are working in the field, it will be in offshore, remote area, right? If offshore means that in uh, out from the shore base, right? It's like in the sea, on the sea. And then uh, when you are working uh, on shore it will be far, far away from the cities, right? Like remote area. And then it's like the risk because of also the pressure, uh, what you are getting from your customer, your client, because of it's involving with a lot of uh, money. It's a, a lot of cost. Client will pressure, pressure you up, right? So that's why uh, we need to make sure when you are joining, right, you will be able to know all the risks, right? And we do not want to hurt the people, but whatever that we do, uh, it's always people got hurt, right? It's always people got hurt. So, so that's especially for the uh, young people. I mean, for especially for the uh, fresh grad, fresh uh, recruiter, uh, fresh recruited people, they always got hurt, right? So because of the risk info. Right. So we are also involving with the radioactive. We are involving with the uh, explosive. So it's fun, but you like challenge. This is like very good, right? So, but it's not. I mean, it's not only um, male work basically. Uh, here in Slamergy also is supporting with the female uh, engineer, right? And my wife was working also with Slumbercy before. Right? She was the QSC coordinator. So, so is no, no limited actually. I mean that, 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 that whatever that you are, uh, your, your gender, right? Uh, don't, don't worry. Uh, when you are uh, joining, we will train you to be able to uh, deliver the job safely and successfully, right? So. The key here is the training, right? You need to be trained. And then you are trained, then, then you will be able to deliver it safely, right? So okay. uh, my question is, so, uh, uh, your manager put you in the, uh, as an instructor because you have yes. a lot of experience in the field then, yeah? Yes, yes, buddy, yes. Okay. So I have... So that's why, right? So when they recruited um, me, I, we start with the grade. I mean, I think it's like all the other uh, company also that you will start with the, whatever that you grade, right? Uh, and then you will move forward, right? So till that level of that grade of, uh, of the level of the instructor, and then they will put you your assignment as the instructor, right? So you can imagine it, right? So uh, the instructor that what we have in Slumberger right now might be is around 20, I think that total 20 or 60 people out of 100,000 people in Slumberger, right? So it must be the selected people only that to be able to join specific position, right? So you are not capable, then you will not be able to be in that position. Okay. Is that answering question, Pardi? Yeah, thank you, Pak Bonofi. Yeah, thank you so much. <laughs> Is there any question from the other students? Yeah, I think. Uh, yeah, yeah, if, yeah. Because what 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 time is it uh, uh, in Abu Dhabi, Pak Bonof? Right now is for uh, forty eight in the afternoon. It's uh, like three hours different between uh, Indonesia and Abu Dhabi. If okay. if there's no other question from the students, I think that we're going to end or or class for today mm -hmm. and really we thank Pak Nofri for uh, presenting uh, about how uh, Salam Brzee, uh, Salam Brzee uh, 
train their employees yeah, and manage their, their employees so they can do million dollars of work yeah, <laughs> around the world. Yeah. So with a lot of training, yeah, the, the conclusion from this uh, lecture says uh, Slam Brasid does a lot of training and it's very, very, how do you call it? Uh, a strict training, yeah, strict training and strict uh, um, uh, qualifications, I think. Yeah, uh, from what I uh, what I get from your uh, lectures, but uh, yeah, I think I think that's all. And everybody say thanks to uh, Panofri for these sessions. Yeah, thank you so much. Please unmute and say thanks to Panofri. I'm going to. Okay, end. thanks a lot, guys. Uh, thanks a lot, thank Padi. You, uh, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Be safe. Nice Take safe, care. Assalamualaikum. Waalaikumsalam. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Ramadan. Assalamualaikum. I can. I, I'll end the class. Yeah, I'll end the Zoom. Yeah. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Waalaikumsalam. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir.